you'll see an actual cesarean surgery as you join Joyce and Bruce in the operating room. Before the operation, her abdomen is washed with an antiseptic. A screen is hung in front of Joyce to create a sterile field, which also keeps her from seeing the operation. To perform the surgery, first the layers of skin and fatty tissue are cut. These top layers are then spread apart to reveal the abdominal muscles. Next, the doctor separates these muscles by hand. Then these layers of skin and muscle are retracted to expose the uterus. The doctor makes a similar horizontal incision to the uterus. The bag of waters is also broken. Once the scalpel makes an initial opening in the uterus, the incision is completed with surgical scissors. Now Joyce's baby is ready to be born. Her doctor guides the baby's head from the pelvis and delivers him through the surgical opening. To make the incisions and deliver the baby takes about five minutes. After examining the uterus, the surgical team stitches it closed and puts the abdominal muscles back in place. The outer layers are then stitched back together. This part of the surgery takes 30 to 40 minutes. While the surgery is being completed, Joyce and Bruce are able to hold and talk to their newborn. After the surgery, the family comes together in the postpartum room as Joyce starts on her road to recovery.